Hey, what's going on everybody? Brandon Charleston here. Just a quick video. I just wanted to uh, post about the new uh, update that Clay has had uh, regarding Ocean.io, which is very exciting. I'm super happy to have this integration, especially with the, uh, the features that Ocean.io uh, brings to Clay. So I wanted to uh, point out uh, just a, a workflow that I, I have identified as far as getting the data and then also being able to write it uh, and parse the information correctly uh, to separate rows. Because as you see here, uh, when you pull different companies, uh, you have an array of data here but it's not uh, usable you know, the way you'd want to use a clay table uh, because it's, you're essentially adding this data as columns, right? So a uh, workaround currently, uh, well, two options really. Uh, number one, you could do write to other table. And so simply, you know, depending on what data that you want to uh, pick up on, you just uh, select right to other table and then you can select the data um, basically you just uh, you know go here and then I want to uh, insert all 10 items for the array of things the thing about this though um, is if you're trying to send all the data you know we're talking description maybe revenue uh, all that stuff it could become um, a little bit of a task you know to really map out uh, all the things here and it certainly works and that's something that you could do uh, but one thing that I like to do uh, is just to send the array uh, to N8N uh, to split it out and then send it back to uh, Clay and so uh, essentially you can see here this is definitely an option and I'm sure Clay will probably be able to improve uh, the product uh, to be able to you know funnel through uh, all the array of uh, data into a new table uh, but what I wanted to do is show you a workaround uh, using N8N and I'm sure you could do this in Zapier and make.com as well uh, but a very simple workflow is you essentially uh, need to create a webhook and then uh, this webhook will essentially um, you're going to go to um, an HTTP request and then you're just going to do a get as it uh, talks about in N8N <clears throat> and then you're going to uh, do the endpoint and then in the body you're essentially going to do open curly bracket results and then I just put the whole thing in there uh, just all of it right and so what that'll do is that's going to let me just move my face here oh actually you can see the entire array has just uh, you know the schema here the entire array of data has all been passed through uh, because I selected the whole thing right and so then what you do is you just uh, split it out and then all I need to do is just I took the results uh, so I can split out the array of data and so it essentially uh, just took just this one company which means it's correct <clears throat> and then what I did is you open up a new table uh, which is a webhook in clay and then obviously you're going to get um, let's see you're gonna get this URL here so obviously you just copy that you're gonna do a post request in N8N and then you're gonna do yeah a post request put that there and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna send the body and then essentially I just picked the entire JSON company right here I wanted to I just dragged that over and then I tested it and then you could see here that oh that's the wrong one the entire data just in one swoop has sent everything else and the thing about that let me just shrink my face a little more so I'm not in the way you can see now it populates correctly where we have the company and then we have all the data as it's appropriate uh, just you know row by row uh, for one company each and so that way you can continue your workflow as you want to um, and be able to you know map out all the uh, columns and things like that and so uh, that is the workaround about how uh, you know I would uh, for me personally be able to just quickly get that going uh, you know as far as ocean.io uh, put that in there so super exciting news um, as always I appreciate you watching this and let me know if I uh, can help in any other way but happy clay making